Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to be doing a weekly vlog this week. Sorry about my voice, it's just been fresh this week so I've kind of got a bit of the freshest flu going on. Um, I've only just done my foundation so excuse like the awful look. Um, so this is my first week of lectures. I'm trying to be quiet because I'm not sure who's asleep in the flat right now. But um, yeah, so it's 9 o'clock and my lecture is at 10. But I live like a real I live really close to where my lecture is like. So I'm probably gonna set off about quarter to ten. So yeah, just gonna finish doing my makeup now. So I'm ready now, as you will have seen me getting ready. I can't put my bracelet on so I'm going to ask one of my flatmates to do it for me. One of my flatmates does the same course as me which is handy because it means we can walk to lectures together so I'll probably get her to put my bracelet on. Um, the plan's for later so I've got a lecture, well it's not a lecture, it's like an induction thing from 10 till 10.40. Then I've got um, one at 3 till 5 so 2 hour 1. Um, so. I'll let you know how that goes because that's going to be like my first official one um, and yeah so I'm going to like make some lunch in between and go shopping for a few things that I need like food shopping so yeah I'll see you later so I'm back in my uni room now we just had like a 40 minute it wasn't a lecture it was basically like a tour of the photography like amenities like the photography studio Hi everyone, so I didn't vlog much today, sorry. Um, basically, we have a Wii in our flat, like a Nintendo Wii, and we invited, oh, we invited a flat who lives a few floors above down to have like a Wii night, but I didn't get my camera out because most of them, again, don't know I do YouTube. I think my flatmates do, but I've not filmed anything yet, so it's like breaking the barrier of filming in front of them. Um, I'm going food shopping tomorrow. I don't have a lecture till 4 and it's only a media futures talk which is basically like someone who works in the media industry coming in and talking to people about like what they do and stuff like that. The lecture we had was two hours long and it was for the module called photographic practices. So the lecturer by Monday wants us to do a self-portrait. So me and my friend, my flatmate, is also on the same course as me which is really handy. Um, and we have been like talking about what we're going to do because there, we had some like um, examples shown to us in the lecture today and someone got really creative and made like, she put like leaves, or, like this was an example, it was like leaves on fishing wire so you know the really thin wire that you can't see like dangled all around her and like I don't know, it sounds weird but it looked cool like you have to see it to understand really. I think I'm going to make a vegetable lasagna tomorrow as well which is probably like the furthest I've gone in the kitchen to be honest. Um, I've made some English breakfast though, which I'm quite surprised about. I think it's like midnight, because we spent so long in the kitchen just chatting and playing um, Just Dance and Mario Kart and then just chatting and eating like chocolate and popcorn and crisps. Um, but yeah, so thanks for watching today's section. So it's Tuesday now and it's currently like 12 o'clock. I've just been up doing, making some breakfast. Um, packed a few things up that I would need to return to I saw it first that I ordered and also um, I put some washing in I did a lights and a darks and I accidentally forgot to put the washing tablet in the lights so I've had to rewash that again and pay for another wash but I rang reception and they, they said they'd give me like an extra credit so that's nice um, I also opened this thinking it was washing tablets and it's actually like a massive thing of washing powder so I'm probably just going to have to leave that stood on my desk because I don't want to put it anywhere if it's going to fall out. Um, so yeah, my, my washing is currently drying on the drying rack and I'm about to go out food shopping. I'll show you my outfit. So I'm wearing my Vans, my mum jeans and then this little white crop top but it is really windy and cold outside so I'm going to put this big, you can't see, this big coat on over the top, um, but currently in the flat it's just so warm so I can't wear that inside. 
taking my eyes off it first order back and I'm pretty sure my hair dry broke on me this morning so it's been eventful. I had some avocado and tomato on toast and avocado is so expensive. Pretty sure it's like £1.5 for one avocado. Um, so I won't be buying those often but I, I really wanted to I really wanted some so yeah I'm gonna be going shopping now and I've got like a lecture later. It's been shopping. That only cost me wait, let's where's the receipt? I've got two bags um, and it only cost me £21. Like, is that a deal or is that a deal? So I'm going to be making a vegetable lasagna tonight. I think I said it yesterday. But yeah, I got all the ingredients for that and then a few snacks and then some tofu and some crisps. And now I'm just going to pack it away. So I've just got back from a lecture, so it wasn't a lecture, it was this thing called Media Futures. I think I said it earlier, so it's people who basically work in the media industry and we don't have to go to them but they're quite interesting. So, And today's was, well this week's was about, um, was people who work in the advertising industry talking about if advertising is dead and how advertising is changing and we watched like a load of adverts and it was really interesting. So I'm glad I went to that. And now I'm going to make a vegetable lasagna. Um, there's currently some flatmates in the kitchen making tea. So I'm going to make, wait till they've like done. Just because the kitchen isn't big enough for all five of us to be cooking tea at the same time. But yeah, it's been a long day even though it was basically my day off. Tomorrow I have nothing to do. I need to plan for my self-portrait which I mentioned. So yeah, it should be interesting. I'll show you my vegetable lasagna when it's done. Hi guys. So yeah, I um, made my lasagna. Um, and I would have shown you, but at the time it was in the oven, I was washing up and I sliced through my finger with the knife that I was washing. <laughs> so this is the so this is the current situation. We had to message the group chat for our block and ask if anyone had a first aid kit, and then we went to the girl who had the first aid kit, who is also called Ella, and I've met her before. I already knew who she was, and she like pro like did a full first aid like bandage on me we had one bandage on and I she tied it really tight and then I had to put my hand up because apparently that makes you stop bleeding I didn't know that till today I took it off and then put this on and it started bleeding through it as well I sliced it so like deep basically I was washing the knife and then I was drying it and as I was drying it I kind of was drying the blade of the knife and then it cut through the towel and then cut through me <laughs> that's always fun but yeah the lasagna took forever to make because I had to make well I didn't have to but I chose to make the tomato sauce and the white sauce as well so I was there making the white sauce and tomato sauce for about half an hour probably more probably like 40 minutes and then I had to roast the vegetables because it was a roasted vegetable lasagna which took 25 minutes and then I had to assemble everything which took probably like 10 minutes and then it went back in the oven for 45 minutes and as it was in the oven we had this whole ordeal of me like having to dress it on my finger with wound like wound bandages and I don't know what I'm talking about. I would have filmed it but my camera wasn't in the kitchen it was in my room so it wasn't very easy to come in and grab it when my finger was literally pouring blood out. Um, but yeah, the lasagna was really nice, but I'm now just going to put all my clothes away, just because they're all dry from this morning, so. Look at all my socks lined up on the radiator. I have so many pairs of socks. I literally ran out today, like, there was none left until I washed today. But yeah, all my pairs of socks. So yeah, let's get packing my clothes away. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect that. <laughs> So it's currently half past time and I'm going to finish today's bit of the vlog here. I'm just editing it and my fingers bled even more. So I love that. Um, it really hurts when I like touch it. But um, the kitchen is finally clean because we like fully like cleaned it. Because yeah, there's usually like dishes but we put them all away. So I'm like it's, it's pretty satisfying to have a clean kitchen. But yeah I'm going to finish today's part of the vlog here. Tomorrow I think I'm going to go to the library to get some books out because I've got a bit of reading to do, which I don't really want to do, but I have to. Otherwise I probably won't understand what they're trying to tell us at the lecture on Monday. So yeah, see you tomorrow. Flash on you instead. This is Hattie. She's the one who went shopping with me. She wants to say bye. 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 <laughs> so it is 
Wednesday now and I'm starting to see the significant difference of how much better I feel because last week when we drank like every night I felt so like shit the next day but yeah um, I'm starting to feel a bit better now. It's now 10 past 11 and I need to try and because I've got reading for next week I've got no reading this week because it's like the first week um, so yeah today is my day off if I didn't already mention that in the vlog but um, I want to go to the library today at some point. I don't know if my flatmate's going to come with me because obviously she's doing the same course so we need the same books. But I've not heard from her yet so when I see her maybe later in the kitchen I'll ask her what she wants to do. So obviously you guys know I have to do the self portrait like exercise activity thing. And I still have no idea what I'm doing and it needs to be in by Monday. And I really kind of want to get that done soon. Like I had a few ideas, but you have to have a reasoning behind why you've done it like that. And I just don't know what the reason would be. I need to decide what I'm going to do. Maybe research a bit as well. So yeah, that's probably what I'm going to be doing for like the next hour-ish. Just so I can come up with an idea. Because I want to be firm and like understanding on where I'm going to, what I'm going to do. And then tomorrow, I'm so excited for tomorrow. So I've got a lecture I can't remember what it is. I'm getting a bus to go to the Meadow Hall student night because they're having Meadow Hall is a big shopping centre near where I live. And both of like two of my best friends are studying in Sheffield, which is not very far from where we are actually from. But we're gonna I'm gonna go down there and meet them and I've not seen them in like three weeks, which you might think is like like not a long like not a long time. But I'm just so excited to see them because it's like a familiar face and stuff. Um and also Jack and Danny from Love Island are going to be there so we might get to meet them and I'll vlog that hopefully. Imagine if I can get them on the vlog, wow. Um, but yeah, that's the plans for tomorrow. So I'm just going to try and power through today, power through the lecture tomorrow. And then I get to go home and see my friends. Student night starts at 5 and finishes at 10 but I'll be back like about 10 to 10. Just going to get the bus back up. So yeah, it's time to research. I've just had some lunch but I didn't film it just because I was in the kitchen with my flat, one of my flatmates. So obviously you guys know that one of my flatmates does the same course as me. Um, she was actually in the vlog like the yesterday section of, yesterday section of the vlog at the end. Um, but yeah, um, I showed her that the planning that I'd just done when you guys saw me do it. And she seems to think that I'm overthinking like this whole self-portrait thing. Which I probably am because I tend to overthink a lot. But I'm just so scared that the teacher is going to ask me the meaning of my... Um, that the lecturer is going to ask for the meaning of my portrait and I'm just going to be like, well, I just wanted to do it like that. But I have come up with some, like, meanings. I mean, they're not great, but oh well. I'm just going to go with what I know, with what I think, just because I don't want to overthink it even more. So this is what I've got. So we've got the self-portrait photography little research section. So I've got um, self-portrait versus selfie because I emailed the lecturer the other day and asked him, like, if we could use a selfie which was probably a stupid question because that's not very creative but um, it's I found online that self portraits allow the subject to be more artistic whereas a selfie is more of a spur of the moment practice and then I had a quote from Deanna Lawson and she apparently takes a self portrait a few times a year and she says it's an occasion for the artist to construct her representation through her own medium it's an opportunity to declare who you are visually and who you aspire to be so I just thought I'd write that down just because it's quite, I feel like that's quite important and I know we're going to be doing more self-portrait photography things later on. Um, and these gaps here, I didn't write anything in them but I might try and stick some photos in, like maybe one of Deanna Lawson and then maybe like a self-portrait versus selfie here. So then this is my self-portrait, so I've done um, idea one and idea two. 
So I wrote like the dictionary definition of superstitious and then wrote a thing on astrology. So I thought because I'm quite a superstitious person, um, I kind of read my horoscopes a lot and sometimes like read a bit too much into them. Um, so in my uni room I actually have my um, horoscope, no, what is it? My star sign um, constellation and then I have it again on this cup here which keeps my pens in. So I thought maybe I could do some kind of makeup with the astrology um, constellations um, on my face. So maybe either just do mine in like a big scale or do all of them because this one's mine and that's Aquarius which is the one before me. Um, so I was thinking maybe I could do them all small all over my face or just do mine in a big scale. And I know it sounds stupid, I feel like it's just like a bad idea and everyone's just going to have like really amazing ones but I'm probably just overthinking it so I'm just going to go with what I think and then my idea too is a bit stupid it's basically because obviously I do YouTube and I make content I thought maybe I could have this camera that I'm filming on now on a tripod and me sat behind it and then the self portrait could be me behind the camera <laughs> great drawing of myself like right that um, obviously I'm not like a massive YouTuber like I've got like 800 and something subscribers but I really enjoy it and I have been doing it for five years now so I thought maybe if I could do that um, that could like illustrate like who who I am I don't know not who I am but what I enjoy because I really do enjoy making content and that's why I've taken a degree that's related to it but yeah those are my ideas I'm going to experiment with this makeup I feel like this one will be like more interesting because it's got like more like I have to do my makeup for it whereas this one I can just literally take like now if I really wanted to whereas this one I have to kind of prepare myself and I think doing these things on my face will be quite fun so I'm going to try and experiment with that maybe later on this week or later on today um, but at the moment I'm just going to snack on these Thai sweet chilli peanuts which I got yesterday from Morrison's, they're so nice. Um, and yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do now, maybe watch some YouTube, just chill out a bit because I've stressed myself out thinking about this. Um, and maybe practice some of the makeup. Today, I need to go to the library later but I'm pretty sure the flatmate that is doing my course is currently doing her research for this. And she's going to be deciding what she's going to do as well, so yeah. Hi guys, so I'm in my room again. I did go out to the library with my flatmate and we tried to find the book that we both needed. There was only one left, well, according to the library there was only one copy left. So we said we'd share it because it was only three pages to read from the book so she could have read it and then me after or whatever. But when we went to find it, it wasn't actually there so we're going to get like an email tomorrow when there's one back in or something. We weren't there for long because they didn't have what we needed but we did go get a coffee because in the library there's a cafe Nero so we went in there and yeah so... I've just been reading, making notes. It is now quarter to six and I'm gonna have a jacket potato for tea and they take an hour in the oven so I should probably start cooking it soon. Okay, so I'm in the kitchen. It's nearly seven o'clock and my tea is in. It's got 11 minutes left. I'm having a jacket potato with beans. I've made myself a fancy little salad. We have lettuce. Um, a bit of cucumber, it was basically like one of those ready made salads but I added tomatoes, mozzarella, um, an avocado, well half an avocado and um, olives in myself so there's a bit of cucumber in there and then this is like a lemon in time dressing that came with it and then I'm just going to put my beans on now to start cooking for the jacket potato also when I was cutting the mozzarella I cut my finger again um, I don't know if I mentioned yesterday but this knife was new yesterday and I think it's already cursed because like it's cut me like really deep on this finger and then like not that deep on this finger but it still stings so yeah just gonna make my tea now waiting for it to come out i'm so hungry because it takes an hour for a jacket potato to come out so i'm starving probably just gonna watch some youtube while i eat tea and um, this is where i'm gonna end the vlog today i've just done my dinner i'm just gonna chill i'm watching youtube right now i've got my virgin my virgin kitchen on if you've never watched him you probably should because he's like he makes such like interesting food but uh yeah i'm gonna go tomorrow's an exciting day i've got a lecture from 11 till 1 which is slightly annoying because it's like that's like when you'd eat lunch but anyway yeah 11 till 1 and then at about i think my bus comes at quarter to three i'm getting the bus to Meadow Hall to see my best friends and I can't wait to see them. I've missed them so much and it's just really nice to see like a familiar face like 
you know, who you've known a while, because obviously I've known these people who I live with for like two weeks, three weeks, yeah, two weeks now, just under, whereas I've known my best friends for like, my best friends that I've made in college anyway, I've known them for two years, so it's going to be really nice to see like, a fa like familiar faces. So yeah, I'll see you tomorrow, bye! Hi everyone, it is Thursday, I'm going home today to see my friends, well not home, but closer to home than I am now. It is 10.40 and the lecture is at 11 and we'll probably be setting off in about 5 minutes so I'll see you after that. So I've just had lunch as you will have seen. Um, the lecture was good, it was 2 hours long but we now have quite a lot of work to do for Monday. We have reading and then we also have like a little task to do so probably doesn't help that I'm going out today but honestly I can't wait. So the time is... 10 to 2, I'm going to set off at quarter past, it's a 20 minute walk and my bus is at quarter to 3. This is my outfit, I'm still not sure on it so I've got mom jeans on like I had on the other day. And then this green top that I bought from Topshop the other day and it's like little button, button up. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure if this clashes too much. I liked the white top with the jeans better but the white top's currently in the wash. Um, yeah, so this is my outfit. Might end up changing it because I'm still not sure on it. But I'm so excited to see everyone. And yeah, I do have a lot of work to do when I get back though. So, well not when I get back, but tomorrow and then the weekend I've got. So I've got like three days, so it'll be fine. Hi guys, so today is Friday. I didn't finish yesterday's section of the vlog just because I was out with my friends. I'm really sorry that this vlog has been nothing but me sat in my room or my kitchen. Um, I, pro I probably should start vlogging outside a little bit more. Um, I have a 9am and it's currently 8am so I'm ready, I just need to do my makeup and then eat some breakfast and then we're ready to go. I just threw a hoodie on, I couldn't be bothered. But yeah, um, I went to Middle World Student Night last night so I thought I'd show you what I bought. First I bought a bra that I've got on so I'm not going to show you that, it was from Victoria's Secret and I think it should have been about £39 but I got it for 19 and then I got a powder just because I needed a new one and then a new beauty blender because Mine's got really disgusting for some reason, but yeah, I needed a new one then. And then also this, which is an investment I feel like. It's so expensive for what it is, but it smells so good. So it's a Lush Snow Fairy Body Spray, and it was £20. But I know it'll last me a while, and it smells so good. I worked at Lush last year, it was a Christmas temp, and staff get 50% off. So I could have got this for £10 if I worked there again this year, but oh well. I can't wait to use this. It smells so nice. The woman like demoed it for me, um, on me in the shop. It was so nice yesterday to see my friends from home. Like I've missed them so much, and like just catching up because, like I said, it's nice here, but not everyone knows you like your friends do from home. So it's always nice to go and see them. So yeah, I'm just gonna get ready now. It's 8 a.m. I look a mess at the moment because I've got to make one. My voice is crooked. Okay. I think I'm going out tonight, but this is the last day of the vlog. Also, last night I met Jack and Danny, so I'll insert the photo here. You might have seen it on my Instagram. Also, I look an absolute mess in that photo. I hate that the photos are so quick and you can't take more than one like you would usually when you're like, taking a selfie. But yeah, um, I don't look my best in that photo, but at least I met them and they were really nice. So yeah, I'm going to go get ready and have my lecture and just finish the week off now. I have so much work to do over the weekend and my mum's coming on Sunday with my auntie so I kind of need to get it all done today and tomorrow. But that shouldn't really be a problem. Also last night, I'm now at the, what is it called? So there's the, we've got the media student like society thing for all, like all the media students are part of it. And I applied to be the social, what is it? I forgot what it's called. The social secretary, which is the person that um, the person that organises like all the events, so like the end of year ball for the media students and stuff like that. And I actually got it yesterday, so that was fun. Um, they were all like at an event, like all the media students were kind of like at Revolution, which is like a bar that does cocktails. But I didn't go because I was at home meeting my friends. So they um, video chatted me to tell me that I'd got the place, which was really nice. And they've actually just added me into the group now. I know I've got a meeting next week, so that should be fun, like take my mind off things um, a little bit and not make me be too serious about like, like just take my mind off things and let me have fun a little bit, like organising some stuff, because I love organising, like it's one of my favourite things to do. But yeah, I'm going to get ready now, see you later. 
Hi guys, so I'm back from the lecture and it was actually quite a fun one. We kind of went over some things I already knew, so that made me feel a little bit better. The homework that she gave us was to watch as many films and TV shows as we can, so that's always easy. <laughs> I'm currently watching YouTube. I've just had some lunch and I really don't think there's going to be much else happening today, apart from the fact that I am going out later, but I'm not going to take my camera out with me, just because obviously I'm going out. I feel like this weekly vlog has actually been so boring because I swear I've not gone out of the kitchen. Obviously I have gone outside but I've not vlogged outside of the kitchen or my bedroom. But if you guys do want me to do more uni vlogs, I guess like, you know, I've been like documenting like my lectures. Not like obviously in my lectures but how my lectures have gone. And I'm actually quite liking the course so far. There's quite a lot of like work to do, like homework if that's what you want to call it. But obviously that's to be expected anyway when you start anything like educational. Right guys, so the time is quarter to nine and I'm ready to go out. Um, I think I'm going to another flat for like pre-drinks at half past nine. But we're doing a few here first. I feel like I'm a bit too dressed up but it's been raining all day so I really didn't want to wear a skirt which is what I usually would go for. So I've gone for these trousers as well, they're like collops and then these, these are like wedges that are flat so it doesn't hurt my feet at all. And then just this little black crop top. Curled my hair. Um, got eye makeup on. Uh, usually I would wear eyeliner if I'm wearing fake eyelashes but um, the other day I lost the lid for my eyeliner so I tried to put like a lid of an eyebrow pencil on it. My eyeliner's dried out but the lid did go on properly so I thought it might hold the moisture in and not make it get dried out but it did so I need a new one. Um, more expense to the student loan. But yeah these trousers are getting tight so I think I've gotten the freshest way. Can't wait um, to get more. So yeah this is my outfit. Not too sure how I'm feeling about it, but I'm not wearing a skirt because it's too cold. It's the end of the vlog now because this is Friday and I'm not vlogging on the weekend. So thanks guys for watching. Sorry if it's been boring, like I said, I've not vlogged outside my room or outside of the flat in general. Um, if you guys do want more, then comment below and let me know. And I will do more uni vlogs and I will branch out and go to different places. But yeah, thank you for watching. Bye!